What is the crack and welcome back to another video. In this video I'll be showing you guys the things I got at the car boot sale slash charity shops. I'm not going to show you guys everything I got in this video because I also got the Doom Collector's Edition here in the background. And two other things I'll show you guys next week just so I have something for next week in case I don't come across anything. If you guys enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe. The reason I haven't been doing videos, I'll just say this real quick. The reason I haven't been doing videos the last three or four days is I have been feeling like shit. My stomach has just been killing me. Like, I get to about four or five o'clock after I come home from college. And my stomach is just killing me. If my camera would also unblur, it would be good. No? There we go. I just come home from college and my stomach is absolutely killing me. And I've been going to bed, like I've been falling asleep at like 4 or 5 o'clock, like just after I come home from college, my stomach start killing me and then I just fall asleep. And I've been waking up at like 5 in the morning. So my sleeping, I tried to fix it, but my sleeping is 20 times worse than what it used to be. So I'll try my best to stay awake and do a live stream tonight. Um, let me know what you guys want me to play. It's It'll probably be like Watch Dogs 2 or Dishonored 2. Or like Doom or I I don't know. I'll pick a I'll pick a random game. I really do not know at this point. But um all the games I've got this week have been Xbox 360 games. So let's get into it. The first game I'm gonna show you guys is whatever the fuck that bitch is. Sacred, I think. Sacred Tree First Edition. Um this is a top down game. Like Diablo, I do not like top-down games, but it's um it's backwards compatible with the Xbox One. So for 75 cent, I get an Xbox One game. I have already installed. I haven't played it yet. I might do it. I might do a little video on it. I don't really know, but uh, I've been really thinking about playing a lot more PC games because I have uh, the Hundle Bundle or whatever the heck it's called was on there the other day and I got a few PC games. I also have a copy of Payday 2 on PC that I might give away. I have a second copy of it so I might give that away. I don't really know. Um, the second game I got but uh, before I want to start doing like mini videos where I record for like half an hour 40 minutes and make them into like 10-15 minute videos like the good parts of it because um, I recently have got Hello Neighbor, which is a good game. I've watched a lot of videos of Dashi playing it. And I'm, it's kind of like a horror game type thing. So I'm going to assume you guys would want me want me to play that. Um, I have a lot of games um, on the PC that I've bought. But um, like I, I have bought a few new games for PC because the Hundle Bundle thing I was saying. But I have a load of games on my PC that I uh, can play. I might have to use my big PC, the one that is, like, bigger than me. But, um, other than that, I should be able to play a few games on this PC. Uh, or on the one I'm recording this with right now. I might have to clean it up a bit because I'm noticing a lot of dust on the bitch. I'm going to clean it up after this video, actually. But, um, the second game I got, Alone in the Dark. I thought this was backwards compatible. And so did my mate, but when I put it into the Xbox, it said it wasn't. I got it for 150. It'll probably become backwards compatible eventually, so that's why I like buying Xbox 360 games because it the all well not all of them, but the majority of them will become backwards compatible at one point. So it's good to buy them while they're dirt cheap, and then when they become backwards compatible, they'll rise in price. So I can sell them back then if I don't like them. So I got that for 150. Another game I got, which I actually had on the PlayStation 3 ages ago, but I sold because I think I just needed the money. I don't. I did like it. It was a good game. I just never. I don't. I don't think I completed. It. I only got to like two, two hours in, two three hours in. Um, Dark Siders. It's a really good game. I got that for seventy five cent. Like well worth it for seventy five cent. This game's amazing. Um, for the people who don't know, it's your like. The horseman, one of the horsemen of the apocalypse, I think, or some shit. You're like a demon guy, and you kill bitches. There, you can see like you're on a horse, but like you kill demons and whatnot. And um, there's a picture of you right there, if you guys can see it. But, like really, it's like an RPG-ish type thing. It's weird how to explain it, but um, it's really good. 
uh, what what was the thing I was gonna say? It's um, this isn't backwards compatible yet. I don't think I, I don't think so. No, but it's a really good game. I really liked it on the PS3. Uh, number two, I haven't played yet. So if I come across number two, I will buy that. I have the second one. It is this. I don't have. I only got the first one here uh, the other day. Darkness got this for one euro. This is kind of like a um, would you call it a horror game? What what does it class itself as? Don't say. But it's a, a game where you are like a guy that has weird like tentacle things and you kill people with them. Here, if you can see it there. They like come out of your body like arm. How do I, it's just like wings, but you come out as like snake wings. It's weird to fucking explain shit. I haven't done a video in a while. Leave me alone. But um. Uh, I have number two, like the collector's edition. Actually, it's right here beside me. There's number two. Yeah, you can see it a lot better on this. It's like snake wing things. I only got, I got the collector's one for two. But a uh, really, really good game. If I remember playing this one, if if I'm thinking of the right game, anyway. Um, another game that I actually got. I might still have my original copy of this. But I got this ages ago, Prey 1 off um, someone, and I didn't have an Xbox 360. <laughs> um, I had one, and they bought it for me, and then it broke, and then they gave it to me at Christmas, and I didn't have an Xbox anymore, so it just stayed on my shelf for like three years, because every time I went to sell it into GameStop, they were like, you get like 25 cent. I'm like, I'd rather keep it, mate. Um... Made by the same people who made Borderlands, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, 2K. Um, Really weird game. It's like you fight alien monster things. I cannot wait for the second one. If you have looked, up, if you look up any trailers, look up Prey 2. When that comes out, I will be playing it. It looks amazing. Uh, the second last game I got. Also, I got all these for under a tenner. 9.50 altogether. For... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven games, and one of them is like four or five times the price of the other ones. Um, I got condemned with some guy's name on it. So if you were the, if you were Calum Arshkablavala, the guy who had a fucking filthy ass box, the box is in absolute bits. But do you know what the most surprising thing is? The disc is brand spanking new. Not a problem with the disc, but the box is in absolute bits. Like, did he just start fucking the box? The box out into a field or something? Like, um, this backwards compatible. This game, who? This game, I've played it before. It's not a good game. Not in a like, it's not a good game in a bad way. It's not a good game for me because I don't like horror games. But um, I might do a video on this coming up soon. Because it is backwards compatible, so I can play it on the Xbox One for one euro. I'm not going to say no to a horror game that you guys can laugh your asses off at. Again, I might do that as like a, a normal video, not as a live stream, and then put it up as the as the funny part. So you guys don't see me pause every two minutes and be like, <sighs> for about a week and a half. Uh, the last game I got is, um, I absolutely i am not a fan of Tom Clancy games. But to get a collector's edition, I'm going to take it. Um, Tom Clancy, Splinter Cell, Conviction. I didn't. I'd never even fucking heard of this game before. Like they're just shit now these games at this point. But um, Tom Clancy, Conviction. I got it for three fifty. I like that. The line art shit here at the back. It's really cool. Um, this one comes with the like some weird uh, gun voucher thing. I think you put in the code. Yeah, you put in the code. And you get the game. Put in that, and you get the. Uh, get what do you get for this? Oh, you get um. Oh, you get the beta for the the next Tom Clancy game, which is what I don't fucking know. I can't read that shit. It's not saying, but um, you get that and you get a cool little like vinyl record um game. And let me put back in the receipt so I don't lo don't break the receipt plan. But um, this one I don't think is backwards compatible. I actually didn't check. I did not check. I'm going to guess not. But um, 
350 this one was the most expensive like the cheapest was uh, the dark siders for 75 cents so for how many i could get nearly five dark siders for the price of this which is actually like what the fuck prices are weird in cx sometimes but um i like it well i haven't played it so i can't say i like it or not but for what i got for 1050 or 950 really good i also got something here right beside me that i really want to show you guys but i'll keep it for next week because it's really good and um, i i'm also going to show you guys the doom oh why does my hand look so good compared to my face my face looks all pixelated or some shit but then my hand looks really realistic the fuck is my camera doing Yeah, over here, over here looks really pixelated, but in this side doesn't. I think it's just because over here is a lot brighter, because my curtain's open. But, um, uh, what's it called? I just saw a random dot just appear up here, like loads of pixelation. But, um, yeah, the reason I've been doing videos is because I've been, my stomach has just been in absolute fucking bits. Uh, and my sleeping has been all over the shop. I keep on trying to fix it, but it keeps on making itself worse. I was thinking about it yesterday. I haven't drank in a while. I think I might need to drink. Like, I, I'm actually serious. I think I might need to, like, get a few cans into me. Sleep. And then just whatever time I wake up at, that'll be my new sleeping pattern. Because... Hair, what are you doing? Normally, normally when I drink, I wake up, like, five hours earlier than normal. But... I can stay awake a lot longer when I drink. So if I drink, I can probably make it to like 1, 2 o'clock in the morning now. And then I'll wake up at like 8, 9-ish. I don't know. I might have to try it coming up um, next week if I still can't get this bitch fixed. But um, I'm going to look at videos now to do the subscriber shoutout series part 3? 2 or 3? 4? I don't fucking know. But um, yeah. Thank you guys for watching this video. Sorry there has been a latency. Latency? A, a, not latency. A decrease. I don't fucking know words. A decreasing number amount of videos. I, I don't know English. Leave me alone. But uh, yeah, sorry there has, there has been less videos the last few days. I'm trying I'm trying to fucking fix them. I'm, I might play some Skyrim on the Xbox. Or some Mirror, Mirror's Edge Catalyst. I got that and I've played it once. I don't know. I still want to complete The Witcher 3. And Ratchet and Clank. They're games I want to complete because I've started. And I, ha I have like 50 videos, videos of The Witcher 3 on this channel. Like it is insane amount of videos I have on that. In like order of... I think it goes... Fallout 4 I've done the most videos in I think... If it's not Fallout 4, it's Fallout 4 and Minecraft. They are very close together. If you include the sh uh, subscriber shoutout series, or not the subscriber shoutout series, they put Minecraft with uh, subscribers, Minecraft might be higher than Fallout. But then Fallout on the Xbox with mods might bring it back up. I really don't know. And then it goes Witcher 3. Yeah, it gets Fallout, Minecraft, very close together, I don't know which one, and then Witcher 3. Like, I've done so many Witcher 3 videos, it's unreal. But, uh, I actually really liked it, it was a really fun game, there's lots of... Deaths! Boobs. I didn't say anything. But, um, yeah, I will, I will be doing a video tonight, hopefully, if my body physically allows me to. I bought six, six bottles of LucasAid. So hopefully that'll keep me awake. Um, so yeah. I actually spent more on the bottles of Lucas than I probably did on the games. I'm watching Walking Dead right now. I'm bombing through The Walking Dead. Just so I can finally catch up to everyone else. Before someone ruins shit on me. But um, yeah. Thank you guys for watching this. If you've enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up. Come rate, subscribe. And hope to see you guys on another video. Real fucking soon. Bye.